Let's dance. Baila Macarena. <laughs> well, and <laughs> you can do it. Am I even normal sometimes? Can you act normal, girl? Just can you? Can you try it? Hello, people! Welcome back to my channel! Salut les amis! Bienvenue et bon retour sur mes chaînes! Hola! Bienvenue à mes canal! Konnichiwa! Watashi no chaneru ni yokoso! I hope you're doing fine today! You had an amazing, amazing, amazing weekend because I was having an amazing weekend myself, you know? Try to rest, I try to realize, but anywho. <laughs> if you haven't yet, please subscribe. It's free, full of adventure. I love fashion. I do give fashion advice usually twice a week, Tuesday and Thursday, every single week. So there's really not a reason for you to not see me at all. I'm just saying. If you have anything related to social media, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, uh, and you can say more to it. Everything is gonna be like down below. The reason for you to show you that even if like 15 minutes you can really be great at finding a great outfit for the night based on something that you would wear during the day at work or anywhere else actually. So it's gonna be five different options. I hope you're gonna enjoy it. I hope you're gonna love it and I'm gonna talk through it. A couple of tips that you can do yourself to be able to just do it and be really quick, fast yet a super stylish from day to night. So shall we do it now? Shall we? As you can see here is the first look for day to go to work for example. It's classic and what actually makes it stand out even more is the color. The colors are really well at complementing each other. It looks comfy, it is comfy, it, the prints make it a little bit more fun for the day. A grateful summer cigarette pants which is really great for my shape but it at Zara but this one at Top Shop and this bag is from I don't remember because it was a couple of years ago the earrings or the jewelry are really minimalistic most of the time I would suggest not to bring big statement earrings to go to work of course you do whatever you want to a big a good lady 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 like so now I'm gonna show you what I can do to go from day to night. to be really quick, fast, efficient, still stylish. Didn't change much to it. Key here is to keep it under 15 minutes or 20 minutes big max. And I did some bigger statement jewelry because it's the night. To go out a little smaller bag is probably what would be another big statement one. It screams sophistication. Just to make it a little bit more cool, you can keep it that way or you can just like do what I call gimmicks appropriate it to your own spices tidy it up open the blouse tidy it up a little bit just to make it look cooler and have the lace tab just be the look or the big visual part of it so it's something that you can do if you have a blouse anything similar to it instead of having to change the top you can just have a little top underneath it so then when you have to go out you can use your top underneath it to have it as a first layer it's a really great way to just layer again your clothing your outfit so that it looks a really sexy and i keep everything else without changing anything so 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 cute let's do the dance of the victory okay <laughs> i'm so bad at just being normal I suck at being normal. I can't be normal. Outfit number two. All black, as you can see. I went from something that probably most people working in my corporate environment would wear because it's much more classic, much more basic, much less colors. Actually, the opposite. There is no colors at all. And go from something so, so simple to something really great for the night out. My basic was the tuxedo pants. Tuxedo pants to me are super classy, but then again, the way you're gonna dress it up, the way you're gonna style them, could make such a difference. I went with like something white, white mills. I hope you like it. It's like 
really much more corporate. The tuxedo pants for me are a really great basics when it comes to anything classic yet sophisticated a little bit. Now let's get to the night outfit based on these tuxedo pants. <laughs> about knowing how what kind of piece you want to add to the elements going from a tuxedo pants you can do a lot you can do the classic you can do the casual you can do the chic and here was an example from going to something so simple to something really chic black on black from the get-go it's something that just gonna give the chic look. great idea to add something more print and I went with my cheetah shoes <laughs> like I like to call them see it's a really basic big classic when you add prints like that to something really blank, you have to be careful because it could be tacky or very shaped. You could choose cuts that are really more on the sexier side or too sexy, it could look tacky from the get-go. But if you want something much more classic or much more androgynous, if I could say it like that, something like a tuxedo pants, for example, to me are my favorites to combine because they give the look and they give the effect. When you add a lace top, sexy, it's really sexy because it's see through and it's lace, but it doesn't look tacky. Everything is covered on the bottom. Sexy, but a sexy lady of the time to add my uh, funny bitty bag from Zara and this top is from Zara as well I'm gonna do a haul uh, on everything that I recently bought again this week so stay tuned for that like not like a girl I feel like I would come here and be like hello you and then stop there <laughs> Excellent for me is like all about looking sexy. Acting sexy is another, another chapter in my life that I've yet to uncover, you know. I'm not there yet. I'm working on it, but I'm not there yet. When I want to be sexy, I look more goofy than anything else. It's almost sad. <laughs> but I'm trying to look sexy and I look sexy. So at least there is like a start here. The rest is to just act sexy. Sometimes it works. Sometimes people wonder what I'm trying to accomplish, you know. Yeah, I wanted to show you the top up clothes because I think it's like a really, really, really fabulous. I love this top because it covers me. I don't feel naked. It's see-through, but at least everything is covered from here to here. <laughs> There's something black underneath it, um, uh, except if you want to like just flash people like that. It's what I call a black tie because I would even go to a wedding like that, to be honest. So um, I don't know. Let me know what you think about it. I think it's cute. Now we're getting to the third outfit and it's this one. Black and white again. To me, everything that's simple is something that is mostly neutral. I love colors, I love to mix match, do that all the time. I'm really, really loving it. But at the same time, for people that are not so used to colors, I think the base and first step here is use to neutral and be able to mix match the neutral. The reason for me to show you more neutrals than anything else is that we tend to have more black and white more than anything else. Probably you're gonna find something similar to whatever I'm gonna show to you without having to shop the same thing that I have. Although it could be nice. This here was my vinyl skirt. Everything but classic. I can't wear vinyl when it's like really really hot but we're getting more towards the cooler seasons fall so it's an option it's an option not a great uh, basic when it comes to having something to wear during the day to so combine with a long blazer because I believe that if the skirt is too short you want to have it with something as long as the skirt so that I feel just more covered that way go from the day to the night change a 
lot more here, but it's like step by step, you know. Change one piece, you can change two pieces, you can add more accessories, you can play with accessories. Love it, you know it. And this time is this outfit for the night version. It's so rock. It just it screams rock and roll here. It's like Game of Thrones modern version. Can I say that? Of course I can. My favorite. It's my style. Much more casual because you can go to the bar with it. I did my backpack. That's my version of it. I love it like that. I did nice uh, sock boots. It's like really hot wherever you are. You can still keep the white moles that I showed you before it. It's gonna work as good. You can see up close what my top looks like. It's literally made of anything metallic. It's so, so cute different but in that zara i'm gonna link it down below of course i did a little bit of shopping and i'm gonna show you what i got for the next video so rock it's so edgy and rock it's my style this feel great in it it's me <laughs> this is what i call being just you and being rock and i love it because it's still like metallic on metallic and then you have the backpack which is still a little bit like leather ish vinyl kind of thing I think it looks great. I think everything looks great together. You can still have the blazer on top of it because I think it's just gonna look as fine. Because of the texture and the fabric mix match. I hope you enjoy it. And I would. This is my fall outfit. I really went from something basic and other pants. Perfect for summer. It's a black one. Basic that probably most of girls we would have in our closet. What I did here was add this cropped up from Zara, recently bought. I have the little bow here. It really, really brings something much more fun to the outfit for to work. It was still black and white with a bit of brown type of shade. I added my mustard moles along with my black bag. I think it's so cute. And I added my belt from uh, Topshop. That I thought was fabulous. I'm gonna show you how I do it to go to the night. I love this stuff. I love this stuff. And I love this outfit with it. It's not a favorite of mine because it represents me so much pattern leather short it's really light on your skin of course if it's too hot wouldn't suggest to wear it for a night out but it depends but i thought it was a so 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 cute because you have something much more sexy at the bottom and then just to like balance it out a little bit you keep the top and so that it's still sexy cute without the tacky so comfy you can go to have some drinks you can go to a date you can do a lot with it, do a lot. We get to see your legs, you know. You get up close here, you can see the look better in another type of way. I love the little boy. It just reminds me of my old me, really, because I've been through a phase where everything to me was so cute. I wanted to just look cute, the little boys. I've always loved boys, so more and more towards like the edgy rock type of side because it's like me, my personality, you know. Just relaxed, laid back, and so with a little bit of attitude, you know. Not too much attitude, just a little bit. Fifth outfit, fifth day outfit, here you go. My cheetah print shoes, which I think were just fabulous because you got really plain colors, you got a black and you got a green. It's a good option to go to work as well. And I really chose to go from something super super simple everybody has it it's a tank top you added just a nice pants which could be this cut which could be a cigarette pants i added my short vest there you go
changed. Well, not so much because I really want from my tank top outfit. This is just, this represents me so much in so many ways. Like rock, edgy, gutsy, you name it. It just represents me. I've had a phase where I was like more gutting than anything else. I don't know what happened to me, the gothic style a big time. To go from my tank top that I showed you, added something underneath a shirt just to not be naked because it's all see through, right? So you don't want to flash people. The see through tool dress from Zara that I love so much. I put that on everything. It's not everybody's cup of tea. I understand. Go clubbing with it for sure. And I would go even have drinks for it. So just to let you know. The back here adds some like silver lemon suede, which actually brings a little bit of brightness to the outfit, but the rest is black. Something else that you can do with this outfit is to add a hat. This one from Chinatown. Amazing. I love it like that. It's the complete outfit. You can like it, you can hate it, I love it, it's me, represents me in all type of way. Let me know if you like it, let me know if you enjoy it, and let me know if it's your favorite. I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you were really really able to find it useful for you and for your own style. With five different options right there because I think it was like a really matter of just being smart that everything that you're gonna do and everything how you're gonna style it you just don't have time you don't have time from day to night to how to find an outfit in like an hour you don't want to go through your whole wardrobe to be able to find a really nice stylish outfit so it was my role and my job today to show you that you can do that as fast as like 10 minutes 15 minutes really the time to just get something really quick on website which is www.eatpreenshop.com that I haven't used for quite a while now but I'm really really trying to get back at it fashion magazine, the fashion magazine, the August edition I'm not gonna do one, it's gonna be a thread to the September I didn't have time to do anything really because I had so much to take care of the last couple of weeks a nice great fashion magazine lookbook you just subscribe right down below because you're gonna have access to the me edition you're gonna be able to have access to every single audio magazine that i'm gonna like upload or do without having to even like check for it so everything is gonna be really simple and really nice for you i have my make a wish lookbook uh, magazine which is a lookbook dedicated to you and then by me where you're gonna have a couple of like style or outfits ideas for anything that you're looking for any event any wedding for example and you're looking for some outfit it's gonna be a kind of guide for you dedicated to you unique to you so it's gonna be really really done just for you so visible on all of my social media you know i'm gonna see you for the next video on thursday so until then like i say all the time smile because it's free <laughs> Bye. Salut les amis, j'espère que vous avez adoré la vidéo, j'espère que ça a pu vous aider. Je suis vraiment allée avec 5 tenues, 5 différentes tenues qui pouvaient passer de la journée à la soirée sans avoir besoin de changer toute la tenue. Super longue, on sort du boulot, les parents les deux, puis on n'a pas nécessairement une heure ou deux heures à louer à devoir se repréparer. Donc des fois, c'est juste une affaire d'être super rapide et de passer euh, quasi 30 minutes, puis max 30 minutes et passer autre chose. C'était vraiment des astuces euh, là-dessus. J'ai vraiment essayé d'aller tenue par tenue et vous dire un petit peu comment est-ce que vous pouvez changer, euh, passer d'une tenue à l'autre sans avoir à faire trop d'efforts. Donc euh, bien évidemment c'est juste en anglais, je fais vraiment mon possible pour avoir des sous-titres, mais je n'ai jamais le temps, je m'en excuse, je me sens super mal. Mais euh, vraiment vous, vous avez pu voir ce que ça donnait de la journée à la soirée basé sur mon site, bien évidemment. J'espère que vous avez adoré, j'espère que vous avez aimé. Si vous avez aimé, bien évidemment un petit pouce en haut, ça me ferait plus que plaisir. <rire> je dis ça, je dis rien. Aimez ce genre de vidéo, laissez-moi savoir dans les commentaires, dans la boîte de commentaires en bas, savoir quelle était votre tenue favorite, ce que vous avez aimé le plus dans la vidéo et si vous avez aimé ce type de vidéo. Magazine du mois qui n'est pas sorti de juin, puis bien évidemment pour août, je ne pense pas pouvoir en sortir un, donc le prochain ça va être pour septembre. Mais d'ici là, vous avez encore accès à celui de mai où il y a pas mal de détails, super bons détails 
pour euh, l'été de toute façon. Donc là-dessus, vous n'allez pas le regretter. Vous pouvez vous souscrire. Puis tout ce qui va se passer par la suite, c'est que vous allez recevoir tous mes autres euh, magazines, Lookback Magazine, direct dans votre boîte email sans avoir à faire quoi que ce soit. Et à bouger le petit doigt. Donc euh, je pense que c'est une super bonne idée. Je dis ça, je dis rien. Autre chose, c'est que j'ai euh, mon Make-A-Wish Program qui est un magazine dédié à vous et fait par moi ou euh, c'est une sorte de euh, magazine où vous avez des requêtes euh, par rapport à des lookbooks, des tenues que vous cherchez je peux vous donner des actions et tout donc c'est une sorte de guide, plus ou moins mais juste pour vous donc euh, si vous avez besoin de plus d'informations tout va être en bas comme d'habitude puis euh, à part ça, le reste va être en bas je vais vous faire de gros 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 bisous c'était un super bon début de semaine Amusez-vous, reposez-vous si vous pouvez. Si vous êtes en vacances, ben vous êtes chanceux. Si vous êtes au travail, ben courage, courage, courage. On peut y arriver, on peut le faire. Au revoir pour ma prochaine vidéo jeudi. Comme d'habitude, autant souriez parce que ben, c'est gratuit. <rire> Bye.